Hey, Steve Mignani here for Acid or Auctioneers and the Great Texas Mopar Horde Event Sale. This is item number five, and this is a 1965 Plymouth Fury 3 four-door sedan. Uh, this has been repainted, I think. Uh, otherwise, it's a very, very nice presentation of the original aqua green with a white painted top. And again, that's a factory presentation. This looks to be very, very clean and straight. Let's put the magnet on the rear quarter panels. Down here is where they always rust, and it sticks. Yeah, this is what it looks like, a very, very clean, straight body with a nice, fresh respray in the correct shade. Let's look inside, and again, it's a four-door. Uh, let's open this door here carefully. Yeah, let's look inside, and yeah, the original interior. How nice is that? Column shifted automatic. Uh, the seat upholstery has been redone on the front. That soft fabric would not probably have been factory, but it's nicely done. Looks good to me. And on the dashboard, look at that. That little horizontal line with those three vertical hash marks. That's a radio delete plate. This car was originally built with no radio. Yeah, you paid about 60 bucks for the AM radio. If you didn't, you got that. So it's a radio delete four-door Plymouth family car. Pretty cool. Okay, let's look under the hood. And again, beautiful green paint. And again, this uh, would buff right out. Let's look here with the magnet once again down low. And it's metal. That's metal. Yeah, there is no Bondo on this puppy. Okay, on the fender, we see Commando V8. So it has the optional big block. Which one? Well, if we go to the hood, this emblem says 383. So let's pop the hood. There's the 383. And see what we got. And yeah, there it is. 383 two barrel. There's no four barrel. It's a two barrel carburetor underneath. And that's okay. You know, it's, this is the, I think, 280 horsepower version of the 383. The four barrel will be 325, but that's okay. Single exhaust. And we have uh, underneath the hood, we have manual drum brakes. And there we go. Okay, manual drums right here. Power steering. Uh, looks nice. Here's the trim tag right here. And again, no signs of rust. Very nicely painted under the hood. The top of the radiator, that has been painted green. That would be black ordinarily from the factory, but that's okay. The detail is nice. Very presentable. Clean this up. It would look fantastic. Here we are on the driver's side of the car. Again, no dents. Uh, clean up on this car would probably make it show worthy. And going inside once again, let's take a peek here. And again, we have the seating, power steering, and manual, uh, the radio delete. Yeah, beautiful car, really good looking piece. Uh, this quarter panel, the, the quality continues down here. And we can see that the magnet sticks. Okay, <laughs> let's do that again. Okay, yeah. Okay, maybe a little filler here. Okay, the paint's peeling a bit. Well, that's okay. But otherwise, um, you know, a nice four-door family car. You'd probably want to leave this alone and just have yourself a nice daily driver collector car for a, a modest investment. What that investment is, that's up to you. So bid away.